Yo, 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 amazing atheist up in this general vicinity. <laughs> Wishing y'all a Merry Christmas. And you know what the true meaning of Christmas is, don't you? That's right, presents. No, no, I kid. The true meaning of Christmas is Jesus. Praise Jesus. And you know, it occurs to me, with the popularity of the Da Vinci Code and the Jesus Papers and all of these crazy atheist authors running around claiming that Jesus never existed, it seems to me that there is a big market for revisionist history when it comes to Jesus. So I was up all night trying to think of some kooky claim I could make about Jesus that would get people interested and make them say, hey, maybe that guy's got a point, and I think I came up with something. In fact, I think I uncovered the greatest cover-up, the greatest conspiracy of all time. Ladies and gentlemen, what I'm about to say will shock you. It will horrify you. It will shake you to the core. It will shatter the very foundations of your cherished beliefs. Ladies and gentlemen, Jesus and Aquaman are the same. Think about it! Jesus' birth ushered in the age of Aquarius. Aquarius, Aquaman. Coincidence? There are no coincidences. Jesus' symbol is the fish. You've seen it on cars from one side of this continent to the other. What would God need with a fish? This is not the Son of God. This is the King of Atlantis. This is Aquaman. Look at Jesus' miracles. They all involved water. Walking on water, turning water into wine, producing a bunch of fish for people to eat. Even his healings had to do with water. I mean, think about it. The human body is 80% water. So when he's healing people, he's probably using the water inside them to heal them. Jesus is the King of the Earth and the Savior of humanity. Aquaman is the king of Atlantis and the savior of huge manatees. Jesus is the lamest of all the deities. Let's face it, compared to Thor and Odin and Zeus, Jesus sucks. I mean, he doesn't have an eye patch, he doesn't have a big ass hammer, he's not a womanizer. Ooh, you need to love one another. Ooh, yeah, that's exciting stuff. Aquaman is the lamest of the superheroes. I mean, Batman's got cool gadgets, Superman can fly and has super strength, Green Lantern can create anything that his mind desires using the power of his ring, and Aquaman? Aquaman can talk to fish. Ew. It's pretty obvious, folks, that these two guys are one and the same. Jesus is Aquaman. Spread the word, let the people know. And embrace me as a counterculture icon for being the first man to notice this obvious parallel. Love me. Love me with your favorites.